Shalom. I'd like to say all praises due unto Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Akadash. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to the whole family members of the elect. My name is uh, Kanawak from uh, GMS Toronto. This is just a, a film that I watched, um, you know, last year. Um, I believe this movie came out. It's, written, it's by Tariq Nasheed. You know, and um, you know he's uh, very. Uh, you know he was started out. Uh, you know he had uh, a lot of books. You know, and I think the art of Mackin and um, the um, and all those those kind of books. And um, then he had like a little podcast. You know, the mid two thousands, and. Um, then he uh, he uh, ex excelled, you know, and um, started going into a lot of documentaries of our people, and uh, he's very knowledgeable of uh, you know of our a lot of history. I believe, uh, you know, he has a spirit like uh, he's probably a Reubenite, you know, because uh, you know because that's how they would. Uh, you know, because that's how they would communicate, you know, very uh, oral law, you know, like oral tradition, you know. Um, but, um, you know, this uh, butt breaking film, I watched it uh, for free. You know, you just have to just find the proper links. You just have to find the proper link and you could watch it. But um, see, out of the IMD uh, B, is 2.6 out of 10 right so uh 1.8 out of 5 so uh you know these uh you know these uh these e's you know e you know they're hurt man you know because uh you know he is exposing their sh their shit man you know and um i don't really agree with certain things you know um but you know but judah you know, they're uh, they're a lot of Judah. They're 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 woke, but um, you know, we just have to wait on the Lord. All right, let's get it. Zephaniah three verse eight. Therefore, wait ye upon me, saith the Lord, until the day that I rise up to the prey. All right, so we gotta wait. All right, you know, like we're not gonna get our reparations or nothing. Because in order for us to be compensated, you know, we really have to take their whole kingdom. And that's what exactly what's going to happen, you know. I think in Daniel, uh, it says, uh, it says the saints shall take the kingdom, you know, and shall rule forever and ever, you know. So that's why we're waiting. For my determination is to gather all the nations all right, because, you know, these nations, you know, ultimately, you know, what we see what's happening in Ukraine, you know, and the Russia and uh, America and a lot of things was happening over there in uh, in Europe, you know, and uh, it's going to go right, you know, to the Valley of Jehoshaphat, Joel uh, 2 and Joel 3, you know, so uh, we're approaching these times, you know. And um, this has to happen, right? Because, you know, these nations, they have taken crafty counsel against. Let's get it after. Uh, that I may assemble the kingdom. I, I, I will, that I may assemble the kingdoms that to pour upon them my indignation. You know, the indignation, when you go into that, it means righteous anger. Let's look at this. Uh, this is going to be just a short lesson, probably 10 minutes. It says, uh, Zaib, anger, indignation. Right? The indignation, when you go to the definition, it means righteous anger. Even all my fierce anger for all the earth shall be devoured with the fire of my jealousy. That's what's going to happen, man. You see that movie with Will Smith? You know, um, you watch a movie, Independence Day, 
the other movie called called the day after you know um knowing and all that you know um you know like this place you know here in uh you know in babylon you know like the whore the harlot you know it's gonna be judged you know for this for their wickedness man even all my fierce anger for i for all the earth shall be devoured no slogan for all the earth shall be devoured with the fire of my jealousy all right so the lord's gonna smoke he's gonna burn them up man all right and uh this is uh this off of this year the book breaking film um it says uh this hist it said this history of sexual exploitation of black people which were not black right but of black people by the domination it's like a by the dominant society it said particular um particularly it said the sexual exploitation of the black men all right and that's what they're doing you know with these whole uh entertainment industry you know um you know this uh you know this pornography industry which is run by uh the small hats you know like they're the ones who run everything you know there was um i watching a video um you know on uh on, you know like uh, uh, i was watching the video um with uh like Charmaine lane and um dj envy and then there's a small hat that came up a couple of days ago um you know i think the anti-defamation league you know and um uh, you know and it's like an hour uh interview you know and uh you know just you know you ju just you know like just pushing that deception you know and uh you know try to control man our people man you know and we see what they're doing you know like we see what they're doing you know with this guy um this is off the Toronto Sun. It says, uh, it's a Warmington. It says, uh, it says students not to take like pictures of the trans shop teacher. All right. And that's what these people are, man. You know, I believe like, you know, like there's another guy. He's like a reporter. This is off of the Rebel News. And he basically, he did the same type of shit. All right, so uh, this is what Esau is involved in. It says, uh, while a trans teacher, like decision to wear large, like large prosthetic breasts. All right, so he's wearing a prosthetic breast, you know, you know, it says, uh, and blonde wigs in the front of high school students does not violate any rules that it says, it says the same so the same cannot be said for taking a photo of this edu of, like of this editor i mean it's like a, of this educator it says uh, according to the halton according to the halton district of school um uh, like school board you know this is basically uh i'm not gonna go into it but basically uh like the students you know like the students really want this guy out you know but you know but they want to push this thing you know and um you know when i'm uh all on, all on about when i'm all on about you know um um cause i go back and forth you know um you know to uh certain parts of uh ontario yeah hamilton niagara um you know so uh london certain parts right so um uh, you know for the past uh for the past couple of years you know um i would go uh i'd be going down you know driving or whatever then basically um you know when you uh when you exit off the uh off the bridge off the sky bridge and you go uh let's say there's a lot of traffic right we uh you know if i'm not driving i'd get someone drive me right so um you know we turn right and then we just go straight down the lakeshore on burlington so you keep going 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 you know 
many like you know like many blocks you know because it's a big you know Burlington big you just go on the lakeshore then you go to Oakville you know as soon as you go to Oakville you know like that's all you see beer beer um, you know rainbow flags all over the place so you're like so when I'm um, I observing I'm observing and you're just looking I'm like you know like you know this is just like uh, you know over here in uh, Toronto you know there's a thing called Church Street right? and uh, you know and basically you know like this is what they do you know um, you know they're uh, the things that they do is contrary like you know like to the Heavenly Father let's get uh, I like Deuteronomy 23, I believe. Alright. This is Deuteronomy 23 and uh, 1. Alright. He that is wounded or have his privy or has or have his privy member cut off shall not enter in the congregation of the Lord. Alright. So we're you know you're like you're not supposed to be doing that. You know, doing these uh these these type of surgeries, you know, and um you know like cutting off your rod you know and want to be a woman all right you know that's confusion um you know so you're not supposed to uh, like there's another slaw slaw here yeah. do i mean 23 slaw yeah. here just checking something Yes, this, this is Deuteronomy 22, verse 5. It says, A woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man, neither shall the man put on a woman's garment. All right, so you're not supposed to be, you know, um, um, like dressing up, you know, as a, as a woman, you know, and you, ha and, and you have nuts. You know, you're, you're not supposed to be doing that. You know, but you know, but you know, but this society goes backwards, right? Because this is what they want to do, you know. They want to, um, you know, emasculate the children and do what they want to do, you know, like to the new generation, all right? Because, uh, you know, watch that movie, man. It says uh, for all, it says it says for for all that do so are abomination to the Lord, all right? And that's why. They, you know, let's uh, look at the comparisons, all right? This is the same thing, basically, but, um, you know, this, uh, so lucky. Yeah, man, this, uh, this film is real, man, because uh, we see what he's doing. You know, these are the same people that's coming back in their stead. You know, the Greco, the as the Greeks. You know, and uh, you know, like the Greco Romans. You know, watch that uh, movie on uh, on Netflix. You know, Spartacus. You know, on um, um, like Spartacus, Blood on the Sand. You know where. Uh, you know the gladiators which were us you know they were doing all kinds of shit you know and um you know and this is the same shit you know what they're doing you know and uh this is very good to uh watch but um you know like that's it man with you know because uh you know the lord has to come and uh do what he has to do man because this place is getting out of hand man and um let's trying to find that scripture uh elect Says uh, Second Timothy two, 
verse 10 it said therefore i endure all right this is uh saint paul it said therefore or the apostle paul it said therefore i endure all things for the elect's sake that they may also obtain a, obtain the salvation which is in like which is in like yeah um like which is in mashayak like yahweh shai all right with everlasting joy right and that's why we're hoping to obtain you know because um uh, there's another scripture let me, see, let me find it elect there's uh i think it wasn't for the elect sake no flesh shall be saved man elect no flesh shall be saved Yeah, Matthew 24. And let's get that. Then I'm going to close. Matthew 24, verse 22. And accept. All right. This is, you know, by the by the Lord. He's writing these things, you know. And uh, accept those. Uh, accept those days should be shortened there should no flesh be safe all right so if the lord doesn't come man you know we're all going to be destroyed we, we, we see what you know we, like you see that we're getting you know a lot of you know like processed food GS, gmo food you know um like the gen like the genetically modified meat you know you know like all these different uh you know all these um you know like all, like all these nasty waters you know like that we have you know like that we have to drink you know because you like you might go and you know like um you know like you get certain you know like you buy oil or you buy uh water or whatever but you know you know but you know that this stuff everything that we everything that we consume is effed up man you know, so that's why the Lord has to come. You know, we're getting um, <laughs> bro, like he, he has, bro, Esau has a lot of things to pay for, man, and uh, that's why the Lord has to come. But for the elect's sake, those days should be shortened. So the Lord's gonna come. You know, um, the translation. This is the NLT, St. Matthew 24, 22. In fact, unless that time of, of calamity is shortened, not a single person will survive, right? So if the Heavenly Father doesn't come, you know, to protect us, you know, from this beast, you know, you know, that uh, we're all gonna be destroyed because, you know, you know he everything's dying you know the fish you know um the birds you know he's you know like this is a man this is the son of perdition man he is the son of perdition he's contrary to the heavenly father man job 924 the earth given into the hand of the wicked man and um you know everything what they do is contrary to the heavenly father you know and just not nature you know this is a man who's against nature man you know but uh with that let us say i'll praise you do unto you how about the honest of the apostles of great millstone peace and blessings to hopeful members of the elect um hopefully this video is edifying this yeah yeah shalom and uh, peace and blessings shalom